Hi guys, I just arrived at LMP 2024 in Chicago. We're gonna take a look at some renders today. We're gonna to go to the short. I'm gonna show you some really innovative stuff. See you there. Hi guys, it's Conchettia. Welcome to Lab Day 2024. I'm here with Alien Million. Alien Million. It's been a long night, guys. We had a party. <laughs> Hi, we are here at Alien Milling, and Alien Milling does a fabulous job with milling all of our titanium bars. The turnaround time is fabulous. I'm here with Rafi, and Rafi, why should everybody send their bars to Alien Milling? Simple. We've created a very simple website. You can go on there. It takes about a minute to load up the items, whatever you want. You check it out. We get the item, and we go straight to milling. Hi guys, I'm here with Stefan Effenberg, the famous soccer player from Germany. Yeah. All, all your German viewers, you will probably recognize him. And now he's in dental business. And now he's in dental <laughs> business with, uh, with XNAP. We are selling the 3D articulation system for Exocut and Freeshape. I'm here at the Exocut course. What else do I have to tell you about ExoCAD that you haven't seen already in my videos? I heard today that ExoCAD is actually the market leader in design software. I was really impressed by that. I didn't know that. But ExoCAD is a buff three ship right now. Thank you guys for everybody who addressed me at the show and congratulated me how great my channel is. I met Rami here at the show and he likes my channel. Uh, Carson's channel is great. You know, I learned a lot from him and, uh, as a prosthodontist. You know, I'm an Exocad user and uh, I've really learned a lot of pearls from Carson's channel. I enjoy it. Always wait, wait for his videos. Uh, MD uh, Master Dental Technician channel is one of the best, you know, resources for Exocad. We are here at the Stratasys booth and I got the strongest printed, 3D printed arm in the world. And I'm going to try to arm wrestle it right now. Ah, I cannot make it too strong, but this thing looks so real. It's it's unbelievable. It's unbelievable how how real it looks, and it's all three D printed. You can see the veins. You can see the hairs almost on there. But even cooler than that is probably the banana here. It 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 feels real. It looks real, and it's hard to believe that this is three D printed. I'm here at the Stratus booth with Gal, and Gal has probably the second coolest accent besides me, <laughs> and Gal is from Israel, and we're going to talk about the Stratus printer. Gal, why, why should everybody get into Stratus printing, especially digital dentures, when you can print cool things like this, like a banana? Why should everybody get into this right now? Well, 3D printing and additive manufacturing as a whole is very popular in the dental industry. And it's what allows us to, produ to produce on a, a large scale. However, when you want to take the next step and scale your business and grow your business, that's where multi-material printing comes into play. We've taken this ability to the next level with our dentures. So now we're capable of printing monolithic dentures. We are here at True Abutment and True Abutment has a great new feature that lets you do a photogrammetry scan with your cell phone. True Abutment has a new innovative workflow that lets you do the same thing that Pig does or iCam just with your cell phone. I'm here at SIN 360 and we're going to talk about the new photogrammetry scanner you can actually hold with one hand. This is Lightning from SIN 360 and Lightning, this is an amazing system you showed me and why should everybody get into this right now? What are the advantages? With other systems, photogrammetry systems, you're going to get a great result. The benefits of the Micron Mapper is the pistol grip is a big deal. I compare it to driving a car. If you can use one hand driving a car, you're able to look behind you. Same thing in an operatory. You have a pistol grip, 
You're scanning a patient in front of you, the camera and or the computer may be behind you. Therefore, when you have one hand, you're able to have 180 degrees of mobility. This is Rayface. It takes a facial scan in less than a second. You can combine it with AI technology, with your interall scan, with your DICOM files to create a virtual avatar. You look good, Caleb. You look really good. Yes, Caleb, your nose is that flat. This is Bjorn, and he's a founder for ByteFinder. ByteFinder is an innovative way to put two bytes together. But Bjorn will tell us a little bit more about this, why it's so innovative, and why everybody should get ByteFinder right now to save time and money in the laboratory. All right. The big problem we have in the industry is that we sometimes receive things like that, right? So adjusting crowns, chair side, having ugly crowns is a big issue. The problem is if you don't have a correct bite, everything you do afterwards will be off. This is Rosamil. I'm here with Tony and I'm working with Rosamil for a long time. These mills are amazing. They mill everything from full art, direct to multi unit, with a desk screw, flat plane. And Tony, why should everybody get a Rosamil today? You got an amazing offer here at LMT for $26,000. Why should everybody go into this right now? Two words the access advantage. They are made with the highest quality of all components, including servo, servo drive systems, preloaded ball screws, and the best thing about this machine is the C-clamp can be loaded in 18 different parts. Tony, yes. why should we mill Sikonia wet? At our lab, we mill all Sikonia crowns wet, and we get an amazing fit, an amazing outcome, but you're the expert. Yes. Why should we mill it wet? That's a great question. So it's a common misconception that zirconia has to be milled dry. When you mill, when you mill wet, you get four major benefits. The first one is we mill significantly faster. We get our zirconia crowns down under 10 minutes, depending on the size. We can also get longer tool life, which means that your cost per part decreases. The margins are, are significantly thinner. We get margins down to 50 micron, less bench time. And the best part of it all, no zirconia dust. I just arrived at the Mio booth. And I'm working with Mio for I don't know how many years. And I can only tell you this is an amazing experience. But I want to hear it from the professionals, from the guys who are actually working at Mio. Well, there's a lot of reasons, actually. Um, first thing is Mio makes beautiful, easy. You can make a monolithic restoration. Um, just hit the shade guide. Very simple, right? Absolutely. In, in one fire. And you do that. Correct? I, I do this all the time. We are actually using Mio at our lab right now for exactly. all our four cases, for regular crown on bridge, for anterior units. One shot, what you see is what you get. I walk into a legend here at LMT 2024. This is no other than Robert Cryer. If you don't know Robert Cryer, you probably live on a rock. If you don't know Robert Cryer and you're doing digital dentures or you're doing dentures in general and you don't know him, you will probably live under a rock or on the moon. I don't know. <laughs> Robert, why should everybody go into digital dentures right now? Well, Carson, that's a great question. And uh, thank you very much for, for the time with you. It's digital dentures are changing so rapidly right now. Right now, you know, we have the capability to improve accuracy and minimize the deviation between the what we was known before as the model, but now it's in the digital model or the digital design. Um, we have improved accuracy, decreased labor time, and the abil ability to re uh, reproduce the denture. So reproducibility is a really key element because you want to preserve the integrity of the design file. So thank you, Robert. In, yeah. in, in, the, in the past, digital dentures, the adoption rate was probably going up really, really slowly. Now, we're going to see a shift in the in adoption, and Correct. it's going 
rapidly up. Correct, correct. Right, right now, we only have about 4% of the population. Say there's about 3.8 3, uh, 3 million dentures done every year. So out of that, or say 90%, 7% of them are still traditional. So a huge opportunity to get into this market. So if you want to reach out to Robert for questions, are you available for questions? I'm available. You can uh, robert.cryer at, at stratasys.com. Uh, um, you know, please reach out and call me and or email me, and uh, I'm more than happy to answer any of your questions. Awesome. Robert. Thank you. Carson. Such a pleasure. Buddy. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Everybody knows I'm a big fan of locators. I'm a big fan of Zest because Zest is an innovative and creative system. I'm here with Todd, and Todd, why is Zest so great? Why is Zest so great? Well, I, I would say Zest is so great because we have we have the locator, but now we also have Locator Fix. So what's Locator Fix? So Locator Fix is a fixed option, similar to what you're familiar with with screw retain, but in, with no screws. So we use the existing current locator, but now we have a different housing and a different attachment, uh, that a uh, different insert that allows it to snap on uh, like a fixed hybrid prosthesis. So make sure you learn more about Locator Fixed on Carson's YouTube channel and learn everything about it. Master Dental Technician, 1914, if you're going to put it in Google, you get right into it. I have a great video about Locator Fixed. I have a innovative library you can download from my Patreon channel. And we're going to feature Zest there. It depends. I'm here at the Three Shape booth, and I'm here with Sarah. We're going to talk about Three Shape Automate, the very fast AI design service from Three Shape. If you aren't using AI right now, you are being left behind. Three Shape Automate is entirely fast. It's 90 seconds. It's incredibly consistent. You get the same results over and over again. You know what you're going to get. It's available 24-7, 365 days a year. It doesn't take a vacation. It doesn't take a sick day. You have a person there designing for you without the cost of a person. If you upload 100 cases and you don't download anything, how much do you pay? Zero dollars. I'm at the iTerra booth and I'm going to show you probably the most exciting things that came out in terms of inter all scanning. It's a new iTero Lumina. And the cool thing about it that nobody, no other scanner has, it has six cameras right in the head, it has a focal point of 25 millimeter, and it can scan reflective areas like this denture. If you want to make a good little denture, it scans it really fast, really accurate, and there are no ad effects and there's no missed scans. So now comes to my vision. Since we can modify the liquid color of our model, my vision is actually to print stumps for your model that are going along with my stump shape guide. So when you do a case of veneer or full portion of the system, you have a model. Now just imagine this tooth being uh, printed in the stump shape. This is another photogrammetry option for Opsic Core. This has a built-in jaw motion tracker. There's also the scan flex that you know from other systems. Here are the scan flex, they look really familiar. And here is the jaw motion tracker by fork. You can operate it in one hand. You can see, like other systems, you have to hold it with two hands. This one you can hold with one hand. So it's really economic. I'm here with Crystal at Pegasus, and Pegasus has probably the coolest washing station for models I have ever seen. Come on here. Look at this one. It has three compartments that a robot is moving through a washing process automatically. You fill up the containers here, and an arm takes it in, washes it, and they come out here. And all you're going to do is unload the compartment.
Thank you for joining me on the journey at the LMT 2024. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you contact the vendors that I showed you here with all the innovative stuff that they're presenting. I had a fun time and I hope I see you next year.